Hi, two numbers, 210 and N, have an LCM of 3,150 and an HCF of 15. Find the value of N. Well, normally we're given the two numbers and then we have to find the LCM and the HCF. Now, LCM means the lowest common multiple, which is the lowest number which both these two numbers, 210, go into. And the um, HCF is the highest number that goes into both of these numbers. That's called the highest common factor. So, so first of all, if we write 210 and the HCF in as a product of their prime factors, so there's two ways of doing that, either by repeated division or factor tree. So I'm going to, here I'm going to use factor tree. So um, 2 goes into 210, so that gives me 2 and 105. 105, well, we know that 3 goes into it because 1 plus 0 plus 5 is 6, which is divisible by 3. And you get 3 and 35. You should put a circle around the prime numbers if you use this method. And then 35 is 5 t times uh, 7. And then 50, so 210 as a, as a product of its prime factors is 2 times 3 times 5 times 7. And 15 will be... 3 and 5, because 3 times 5 makes 15. Now, so 15 is 3 times 5. Now, if we draw a Venn diagram, so here's my Venn diagram. So this, all these represent 210, then all these represent the number n. So if we put in the HCF first, which is the common bit, 3 and 5, and cross them off as we do it, then over here we must put 2 and a 7, and then we will need to know what to put here. That's what we've got to find out. We'll let that bit be x. And then 3 times 5 times x will make my number n. So if we think uh, that we have, we know that the LCM is 2 times 7, so we do 2 times 7 times 3 times 5 times whatever's in here makes the LCM. So it gives you 3,100 so 3,150, and then we already know that 2 times 7 times 3 times 5 is 210. So 210x will give me 3,150, and therefore x is equal to 15. So we'll put 15 in there, and then hence n will be 3 times 5, everything's in this red circle here, times 15, which will make 415. So the two number, the other number was 415. Okay, so this has been a video to show you uh, how to find a missing number when you know the LCM and the HCF of both the numbers. I hope you've uh, enjoyed this video and learned something. And if you've got a moment, maybe you could take time to subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much for watching.